Hello and welcome to Puzzles Please. I'm Maddie and today I'm going to be taking a look at the Schmidt Thomas Kincaid Disney Puzzles. Schmidt are a well-established German manufacturer of puzzles and they don't just do Disney or Thomas Kincaid designs. They have like a really wide variety of puzzles they produce. Thomas Kincaid, also known as the Painter of Light due to how he uses light in his paintings. He didn't just paint Disney, he did a lot of landscapes. These particular designs are from the Kincaid Studios and his work was always very dreamy and quite twee. But Thomas Kincaid was apparently a lifelong admirer of Disney. I have already completed quite a few Kincaid puzzles, including this one here, which is Snow White Discovers the Cottage. I've recently put the time lapse of this one out on the channel. I'll pop the link under the video. I haven't done this one though. This is Mickey and Minnie Sweetheart Cove. It's still in its cellophane wrapping there. So this is the one I'm going to be puzzling together today. We can see the box is the classic puzzle box shape and size, about the same size as the Ravensburger box. And on the front, we've got a full image of the puzzle. On the back, we have got a bit of information about the puzzle features, such as it comes with a matte finish. And over here, some images of some of the other Disney puzzles that Schmidt produce. The sides of the box all show the image. Here we've also got the size 693 by 493 millimeters when we get this complete. Okay, I think it's time we take a look inside. Let's get the cellophane off. The puzzle comes in a sealed bag, but we don't get any extra images of the puzzle inside, no leaflets, just our puzzle, so we're going to have to rely on the box image. Now let's see what these pieces are like. First impressions pieces feel nice and strong, they look like they're glued on well and they come on a blue cardboard. The finish is a matte varnish which will reduce reflection. I've just finished the first step of sourcing the pieces and there was a bit of puzzle dust but not too much. I find when you're sorting a puzzle you get a real feel for the pieces and all the pieces in this puzzle really well, none were stuck together, none of the pictures were peeling off and they're really sturdy and the pieces are nice and thick and strong. I've done a good thorough sort on the pieces for this puzzle but I do find the colours and the brush strokes in images like this can make them quite challenging. Okay without further ado let's get puzzling. completed a large portion of the puzzle but there is still quite a way to go. Mickey and Minnie were really easy to put together and so cute. I do love the classic Disney. The sky was also surprisingly easy to put together with all the wonderful colours. It's such a beautiful sky. And I'm now left with the water and the flowers for this area which doesn't look too bad in the picture but as you can see, the pieces are quite dark and with the flowers, the colours 
there is multiple places so I think I've got the hardest part still to go. Regarding the quality of the Schmidt puzzle low, I'm very impressed. The pieces fit together very nicely and you certainly know if you have one in the wrong place. The puzzle pieces are all standard shape, however you do get a lot more of the less common shapes such as these. A lot of the puzzle pieces also have quite a quirky cut such as here the LT bit goes downwards and the hole here is going downwards which makes it easy to identify where it fits. Time to get back to the puzzle, so wish me luck! Mickey and Minnie Sweetheart Cove is complete. Just before I sum up my experience of the puzzle, I'll just say if you have any questions then pop them in the comment section under the video or if you want to share your experience of Schmidt or Kincaid and if you would like the video and subscribe to the channel that would be great too. Okay so first let's have a talk about Kincaid. The artwork is dreamy but the brush strokes and colours do make it a little bit more challenging. From my experience, I have found the Disney Kincaid images easier to puzzle than the landscapes. For example, I did this puzzle before Christmas. All that snow and the dark trees, oh, that was hard. Schmidt are not the only people to manufacture Kincaid puzzles, but I have been really pleased with the quality of the Schmidt puzzle the printing is beautiful, the pieces nice and strong and fit together snugly. You know the puzzle pieces fit nicely together when you can do this. Luckily I've managed to get the puzzle back down on the table safely. I have really enjoyed this puzzle. The hardest part was the flowers in the, all the different areas. And my favourite part was actually the sky over here. These colours, I really love them. Okay, I think that's everything for today. So I'll say thank you for watching and happy puzzling.